Okay. Welcome to our special board meeting. It's March, Friday, March 22nd. Um, roll call, please. Mrs. Miller? Here. Mrs. Morris? Here. Mr. Jewell? Here. Mrs. McIntosh? Here. Mrs. Milligan? Here. Can we go ahead and stand and say pledge allegiance? Today we're um, doing an appointment of Robert Fisher as superintendent on a three-year contract beginning August 1st, 2024 through July 31st, 2027. Do we have a first? So moved. Mr. Jewell? Second. Second. Ms. Milligan, roll call please. Mr. Jewell? Yes. Mrs. Milligan? Yes. Mrs. McIntosh? Yes. Mrs. Morris? Yes. Mrs. Miller? Yes. I wanted to take um, a couple minutes and thank Tom Isaacs for the Warren County ESC for helping us with this extensive search and free of charge. I would also like to thank the board for the hours of reading and research and dedication to find the right fit for our district. Thank you, the ambassador, Dr. Bale, for sitting through some long meetings. I appreciate everyone's willingness to set aside many evenings as we diligently work to get to our decisions. We are all excited about our choice and future here at Carlisle Local Schools. It is with this board's honor to introduce our new superintendent and leader for the Indians, Mr. Robert Bob Fisher. I've never been told I need to speak loudly, so. I will keep it short as well. When they were talking about long meetings, they were probably just referring to my interview more than likely. Uh, my name is Bob Fisher. I'm very excited to be coming back to Carlisle. Uh, coming back for a homecoming is, as I look around, I do see some very familiar faces from my days here when I was an assistant principal. Um, very quickly, uh, 30 years of education. Uh, the last 20 have been as a building, either a building administrator or superintendent. So I'm very excited about the opportunity. Um, what I can leave you with very quickly as we wrap this up, because I'm sure it's Friday night, and I know there's basketball and a lot of other things going on tonight, but one of the things you will get from me is transparency. I very much believe in being upfront and being honest and, and making sure people are aware of what's going on. And, and communication, those are two of the biggest things that I have built my career on. I believe it's very important for all those things to happen, because if we don't, you're going to have a lot of unhappy people, and that's the last thing that we want. Um, I think if you ask anybody from the places I have been, uh, the way that I lead, the expectations we have for classes, the things that are going on um, are very important to me. I have a vision in my head of what I believe classrooms should look like and what schools should be for kids, and I have built my administrative career as a principal and now as a superintendent on making sure that those things happen. So, very excited about uh, getting started uh, within the next few weeks. Once you guys get back from spring break, you'll probably see a lot of me because I do plan on... Um, being here at the school and getting a chance to meet with teachers, getting a chance to meet with all of our staff uh, to uh, get started and try to get a feel for where things are and then get rolling in August. One little special thing that I will throw out, because um, I am a very unique individual, I think is the best way to state it, um, is Dan Slash, because he's known me probably the longest of, of this group from what I've done as administrator, but I am a certificated bus driver. So I figured I'll throw that out tonight, and I have been known to do some bus routes periodically. So that was one of the goals. I just hopefully tells a little bit about who I am. Um, I will do anything I can to help our district because of the fact that transportation is an issue and knowing how hard it is to get bus drivers. I took the time to go out to get the CDL and, and learn how to be a school bus driver. And it's unique in its own experience, but hopefully that gives you a little glimpse as to who I am. So. I'm excited to get going and uh, continue to build our tribe together. So, thank you.
okay? Does anyone want to have a motion to approve? Bill? Second. Mrs. Morris? Second. Roll call, please. Mr. Jewell? Yes. Mrs. Morris? Yes. Mrs. Miller? Yes. Mr. McIntosh? Yes. And Mrs. Milligan? Yes. Time is 6 11.